So I was born with a vision impairment. Um, I had I have benign tumours on my optic pathway which affected my sight. However, around four years ago, that was worsened when I flicked myself in the eye with an elastic resistance band, which forced a lot of pressure onto my optic nerve, worsening my sight. I got to the point where I couldn't go out anymore, where I couldn't see well at night. I didn't just didn't have the confidence to use my cane. So I went through the guide dog application process. Um, after being told I was on the waiting list, I actually had a um, youth Experience Day, which guide dogs run for um, youth vision impaired individuals. And it was where you got to experience what it was like to walk a guide dog. Little did I know, they were doing a secret trial with me and Jonty. Um, and then a few weeks after that trial, I found out I'd been matched with Jonty. And then um, a couple of weeks after that, we started our training together. The first time I met Jonty, it was really overwhelming. It was at a point when I realised I had to get a guide dog, but I knew everything was going to be okay thanks to him. So it was a combination of immense sadness knowing you've gotten to that point in your life where you need that extra help, but it was also immense relief from knowing that you've got that help and that you're never going to be alone again. Jonty has changed my life in so many ways. He's given me independence and confidence. He has changed me from the kind of person who wouldn't be able to go out by himself or would have to hold the elbow of someone to someone who is helping lead and guide people <clears throat> who do not know the area. I'm able to go out with friends. I'm able to get to work in the early morning when it's completely dark. Because of him, I am able to live a life that anyone would be able to live. When you have low vision or blindness, you become com comfortable in an area you do frequently, like your house. However, when it gets to the point when you need to leave your house, as there's so many changing obstacles and environment, it can become really overwhelming to leave your routine. But thanks to Jonty, I can have different routines daily and do anything that I want to do whenever I want to, thanks to him. I think the biggest learning curve was trust. And we were actually, when we were training, we were walking along and a car turned right in front of us into a driveway and I didn't see it and Jonty blocked me and stopped me from walking out in front of the car and that was a time when I really learned I could rely on him to stop me from walking into harm's way. I think that Jonty also learned that he knew I would follow his instructions and that I'd be with him. Probably one of the best moments I had of Jonty when I was in Adelaide for a cycling event and we got to the point where my phone died so I couldn't use Google Maps and I had no idea where I was. However, Thanks to his training, I was able to ask, find the bus or find someone, and he helped me get directions and find the route I needed to find. And it was just such an empowering moment knowing that I could function like anyone else, that I could find my way in an area where I had no idea where to go, thanks to the incredible gift that guide dogs provide. The most, one of the most memorable moments of Jonty was when I introduced him to my whole family. My uncle had a massive party at their farm in the Blue Mountains, and I had the opportunity to introduce Jonty to around 50 to 60 members of my family all at once. And that weekend really showed them how much Jonty changed my life and how much independence Jonty gave me. And it really allowed me to prove to them that I'm going to be stable for the rest of my life and that Jonty will always be by my side. A major location that I would avoid before having Jonty was the mall. And being a teenager, not being able to go to the mall is a real issue. Um, however, thanks to Jonty and his amazing crowd management skills, I'm able to go there whenever I want. And the first time I went there with him, it was so relieving because I hadn't been there in months and it really allowed me to feel like a normal teenager again. A massive part of having a guide dog is not only that physical guidance, but also that emotional support. When you lose your vision and have low vision or blindness, it's emotionally draining. Seeing others go about their lives, seeing friends get their L's or P's, seeing family members be able to drive and live their life without any mobility aids, it's really draining. However, 
when you have someone by your side who's such an incredible presence and such an amazing thing to have, it really compensates for that loss and allows you to feel that hole you may feel.